Another day, another story. What is the effect of not knowing your biological father? People who do not know their genetic father often develop identity problems. The identity with the unknown father, to whom they attribute all the personal characteristics that they cannot trace to others. Consequently, such characteristics are less strongly felt as being part of one's own personality. How many children don't know their father? More than 20 million children live in a home without the physical presence of a father. Millions more have dads who are physically present, but emotionally absent. What percent of dads aren't t actually the biological father? Of all the possible fathers who take a paternity test, about 32% are not the biological father. But remember, this is one-third of men who have a reason to take a paternity test, not one-third of all men. July 8, 2010. Is it important to know your biological father? Knowing one's biological parents yields self-knowledge that has significant and irreplaceable value with respect to such identity formation. Therefore, it is immoral to intentionally create children that will not know both of their biological parents. February 12, 2012. Is it true that 1 in 25 fathers is not biological parent? They estimate that the median rate of paternal discrepancy revealed by these studies is 3.7%, affecting about 1 in 25 fathers. Around 1 in 25 men could be unknowingly raising children to whom they are not biologically related, say UK researchers. The team, based at Liverpool John Moores University, has reviewed previous studies to estimate the rate of paternal discrepancy worldwide. They found that the proportion of families in which a who is your real biological father? Around 1 in 25 men could be unknowingly raising children to whom they are not biologically related, say UK researchers. The team, based at Liverpool John Moores University, has reviewed previous studies to estimate the rate of paternal discrepancy worldwide. They found that the proportion of families in which a man is not the biological father of his child ranges from less than 1% to as much as 30%. The researchers say their findings, published in the Journal of Epidemiology and Community Health, have huge implications for the use of genetic testing in forensic and health settings. The team based their results on 17 papers and conference abstracts published between 1950 and 2004. They estimate that the median rate of paternal discrepancy revealed by these studies is 3.7%, affecting about 1 in 25 fathers. However, the researchers say that the increasing use of DNA techniques in judicial and medical procedures, as well as an increase in paternity testing, means that this figure is set to increase. They warn that disclosing non-paternity can lead to family breakups and violence, but that leaving paternal discrepancy undiagnosed could mean that people will infer incorrect medical information. The studies reviewed came from several countries, including the US, Finland, New Zealand, South Africa and Mexico. The importance of the 4% figure lies not so much in the figure itself but in the implications, given that as a society we are increasingly making our decisions on the basis of genetics, according to team leader Mark Bellis. If, for example, someone knows that their father had a history of family heart disease, they might be tempted to alter their own diet. He said, adding, Obviously they need to be making that decision on the basis of accurate information about who their father really is. In the UK, demand for paternity tests has increased tenfold in the last 10 years, with somewhere between 8,900 and 20,000 tests being carried out every year, according to paternity testing firm University Diagnostics. And in the US, the number of paternity tests has increased from 142,000 in 1991 to 310,490 in 2001. The results of such tests are not always delivered with the necessary support and counseling, says Bellis. Adrian Burgess, of Fathers Direct, told BBC News Online that a code of practice should be put in place to ensure that companies offering paternity tests also offer counseling. Thanks for watching.